Okay, uh, I'm going to explain about selecting enemy inside viewport. Um, so first, I'm going to place this two enemy. And if you go <coughs> demo and Kato blueprint, you can find this node. Um, Here, find the target is in viewport. Just to, um, just to use this node when you select some uh, enemy. For example, if you have experience of, about playing the long dark, and that ulp uh, when you see ulp uh, ulp will uh, wait a second. Uh, I don't remember that, but. Uh, if uh, Ulp follow you and uh, don't see Ulp, Ulp, Ulp just works and just following, keep following. But if you see uh, Ulp, then Ulp will attack you. Uh, in this case, you can uh, select that Ulp. You, you, so you, you can use it like that. If you see Ulp do something, but if you do not see, see Ulp, then do something. In this case, you can, when you see enemy, uh, when you see ulp, then do something. You can use like this. This is uh, within, in 2000 currently, you can change this value. Uh, you can select enemy. Uh, yeah, just use this uh, node. For uh, example, currently there's another. Uh, Input M. Yeah, M. Y here is node you can select. And uh, currently, if I, I can see this three enemy. Press M. Yeah, I can select. Currently, uh, I just uh, set frozen to easy to see. This is not important thing. Important thing is this: you can select the inside viewport enemy. So now press M. You, I can select this. Also, I can select like this. Yeah, only two things selected. But there is one more. Yeah, one more thing. Or, or, or. Just I'm going to. So uh, I can. Yeah. Uh, now. Uh, now. Impossible. Yeah, just uh, hmm. same. Just press M. Yeah, only these two characters selected. But also, if you uh, reduce this value, ten. If you press M, nothing happened. If you increase, uh, yeah, but this is not over one or five hundred seven maybe. Yeah, this two, two enemy will. Really Select it. You can use like this. Okay, this is simple note. Okay, thank you. See you next video.